hello guys welcome back to my channel so today we are going to make this cute little pig so what you're gonna need is you're gonna need two kinds of yarn so you're gonna need the light pink yarn and the the uh, dark pink yarn if you want and also is this crochet hook which is 3.5 millimeters so let's get started okay so we're going to start with the head and for the head we're going to start with the magic ring first so we're going to do the magic ring and then we're going to do six single crochet into the magic ring so we're going to do one two three four five and six okay then I'm going to pull the yarn to close the gap okay so after that uh, we're going to start to the second row and in the second row we are going to increase each stitch all the way around for a total of uh, 12 single crochet in the second row so we're going to do two single crochet in the first stitch so do two single crochet in the same stitch okay so you're going to do that again so two, two single crochet in each stitch all the way around until the end okay so repeat that all the way around until here at the end okay so after that uh, in our third row we're going to do a single crochet then increase in the next stitch and repeat that all the way around for a total of 18 single crochet so we're going to do single crochet then increase in the next stitch so you're going to do two single crochet in the same stitch okay then repeat that again so single crochet and increase in the next stitch so you do two single crochet in the same stitch okay so you're going to continue doing that all the way around until here at the end okay so after you're done with that uh, in our fourth row we are going to start with single crochet then increase in the next stitch so we're going to do single crochet increase in the next stitch okay and then after that uh, we're going to do two single crochet I mean single crochet in the next two stitches then increase and then two single crochet in the next stitches increase and repeat that five times okay so we're going to do single crochet single crochet then increase Okay, and then we're going to repeat that again four more times so we're going single crochet single crochet then increase okay so repeat that until you have uh, one single crochet left here at the end okay and then i'll show you how to do the next stitch okay so after you get to the end you have one single crochet left over here so you just do single crochet to finish up that row okay and then we're going to start our next row so in the next row we're going to do single crochet in the next three stitches then increase in the next stitch and repeat our pattern all the way around for a total of 30 stitches so we're going to do single crochet one two three okay and then we're going to increase in the next stitch so we're going to do two single crochet okay and then we're going to repeat that again so three single crochet one two three increase in the next stitch 
okay so repeat that all the way around until here at the end okay so after that uh, we're going to start with our sixth row and in our sixth row we're going to start with two single crochet then increase so we're going to do one two single crochet then increase in the next stitch so we're going to do two single crochet in the same stitch okay and then after that uh, we're going to do single crochet in the next four stitches increase and repeat that five more times so we're going to do single crochet one two three four increase in the next stitch so we're going to do two single crochet in the next stitch okay you're going to repeat that again so you're going to do four single crochet increase four single crochet increase all the way around until you have two single crochet left over here and then we finish up with single crochet in the last two stitches okay so after we get at the end of the row we're going to do single crochet in each of the next two stitches of the remaining two stitches okay okay so after that now we're going to start our seventh row and in our seventh row we're going to do single crochet in the next five stitches increase and repeat all the way around for a total of 42 stitches so we're going to do single crochet one two three four five and then increase in the next stitch so you're going to do two single crochet in the same stitch okay so repeat that all around so five single crochet increase all the way around until here at the end okay so after you're done with that uh, in our eighth row we're going to start uh, with three single crochet then increase so we're going to do one two three and then increase in the next stitch okay and then after that now we're going to do six single crochet increase and repeat that all the way around until you have three stitches left here at the end so we're going to do one two three four five six and then increase in the next stitch okay Okay, so you're going to repeat that again so six single crochet increase six single crochet increase until you have three stitches left here at the end and then we're going to finish up with single crochet in the last three stitches so you have a total of 48 stitches in this row okay so we finish up with single crochet in the next three stitches in the last three stitches so you're just going to do single crochet single crochet single crochet then we'll be done okay so now in our next row we are going to do single crochet in the next seven stitches then increase and repeat the same pattern all around for a total of 54 stitches so we're going to do one two three four five six seven and then increase in the next stitch so we're going to do two single crochet in the same stitch okay so repeat the same pattern all around so seven single crochet increase and repeat all the way around for a total of 54 stitches so when you're done with this round which is our round, round nine 
okay so also in the next row you're going to do single crochet all the way around for a total of 54 stitches also in the 10th row so I'll see you when you're done with your 10th row so that we do the 11th row together okay so after we're done with our 10th row in our 11th row we're going to start with four single crochet first and then uh, after we do four single crochet we're going to increase in the next stitch so we're going to do one two three four okay so after that we're going to increase in the next stitch so we're going to do two single crochet in the same stitch okay and then uh, after that uh, we're going to do eight single crochet then increase and repeat that all the way around until we have four single crochet left over here so one two three four so you do until here okay so we're going to do uh, eight single crochet first so we're going to do one two three three four five six seven eight and then increase in the next stitch so we're going to do two single crochet in the next stitch okay so after that uh, you're going to repeat the same pattern all around so you're going to do eight single crochet increase all the way around until you have four stitches left here at the end and then we'll do single crochet until the end so we have a total of 60 stitches in this row okay so after you get to the end you're going to do single crochet in the last four stitches we're going to do single crochet single crochet all the way until the end okay so after you get here at the end uh, in our next eight rows which is from row 12 until row, to, row 19 we're going to do single crochet all the way around for a total of 60 stitches in each row so please do single crochet in row 12 until row 19 and i'll see you when you're done with your 19th row so that we start with the 20th row together okay so after you're done with your row 19 in our 20th row we're going to start decreasing and we're going to start with four single crochet and then decrease in the next stitch so we're going to do one Two, three, four, and then we're going to decrease in the next stitch. So I'm going to go in the front loop of the first stitch, pull through, and front loop of the next stitch, pull through, and then pull through all the three loops. Okay, and then after we're done with that, uh, in our next row, I mean in the next eight stitches, we're going to do. 8 single crochet decrease 8 single crochet decrease and uh, we're going to repeat that all the way around until we have four stitches left here at the end so we will have a total of 54 stitches in this row so we're going to do one two three four Four, five, six, seven, eight. 
okay so after you do eight stitches we're going to decrease in the next two stitches so we're going to go in the front loop of both stitches and pull through okay so you're going to repeat that all the way around so eight single crochet decrease all the way around until you have four stitches left here at the end okay so after you're done with that when you get here at the end we have four stitches left so we're going to do single crochet in each of the next four stitches so you're going to do single crochet single crochet single crochet until we're done okay so after we are done with that so as you already see i already attached my eyes so i attached my eyes in uh between row 16 and row 17 and they are nine single crochet apart so i like to attach them because i have to secure them at the back i, I like to attach them before i stuff my head okay so after we're done with that in our next row we're going to do single crochet all the way around until the end so we're going to have a total of 54 stitches in the next row so i'll see you when you're done with your next row so that we do the 22nd row together so after we're done with that uh in our 22nd row we're going to do single crochet in the next seven stitches then decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 48 stitches so we're going to do one two three four five six seven and then decrease in the next two stitches Okay, and then you're going to repeat that all the way round again so seven single crochet decrease and repeat all the way round until the end okay so after you're done with that uh, we're going to start with our row uh, 23rd 23 and in our 23 row we are going to do three single crochet and then decrease in the first three stitches so we're going to do one Two, three, and then decrease in the next two stitches. Okay, and then after that, we're going to do a six single crochet, decrease and repeat all the way around until we have uh, three stitches left here at the end. Okay, so we're going to do six single crochet. So we're going to do one, one, two, three, four, five six and then decrease in the next two stitches okay so you're going to repeat that again six single crochet decrease until you have three stitches left here at the end after you get here at the end in the last three stitches we're going to do single crochet in each stitch so we're going to do single crochet one two and three okay so after that uh in our 24th row we are going to do five single crochet decrease and repeat six times for a total of 36 stitches so we're going to do single crochet one two three four five and then decrease in the next two stitches
okay so you're going to repeat that all the way around for a total of 36 stitches so you're going to do five single crochet decrease five single crochet decrease until here at the end okay so after we're done with that in our row 25 we're going to do two single crochet first and then decrease so we're going to do one two and then decrease in the next two stitches okay and then after that we are going to do four single crochet decrease all the way around until we have two single crochet left here at the end okay so we're going to do four single crochet so one one two three four and then decrease in the next two stitches okay so you're going to repeat that all the way around until you have Two stitches left here at the end so we have a total of 30 stitches in this row okay so after you get here at the end so we have two stitches left so you're just going to do single crochet in the next two stitches single crochet and single crochet okay so after that in our next row which is our row 26 we're going to do single crochet in the next three stitches decrease and repeat all the way around for a total of 24 stitches so we're going to do one two three and then decrease in the next two stitches Okay, so you're going to repeat that all the way around so three single crochet decrease all the way around until here at the end okay so after that in our last row which is our 27th row we're going to start with single crochet then decrease first so we're going to do single crochet and then decrease Okay, and then after that we are going to do two single crochet decrease and repeat all the way around until we have one stitch left here at the end okay so we're going to do two single crochet so one two and then decrease Okay, so repeat that all the way around so two single crochet decrease until you have one stitch left here at the end and then when you get here at the end so do single crochet in the last stitch and then uh, cut off your yarn and leave it leave long enough for stitching and then after that I'll show you how to make the body okay so for the body we are going to start with the magic ring going to do magic ring and six single crochet into the magic ring so we're going to do one two three four five six Okay, so after that we're going to increase in the second row okay so we're going to do two single crochet in each stitch in the next row for a total of 12 stitches so we're going to do one two single crochet in the first stitch and then we'll do two single crochet in the next stitch ok 
okay so do two single crochet all the way around until here at the end okay so after that uh, in our third row we're going to do single crochet increase single crochet increase all the way around for a total of 18 stitches in this row so we're going to do single crochet and then increase in the next stitch Okay, and then we're going to repeat that all the way around so you're going to do single crochet increase single crochet increase all the way around until here at the end okay so in our fourth row we are going to do two single crochet increase and then repeat the same pattern all the way around for a total of 24 stitches so we're going to do one two and then increase in the next stitch so you're going to do two single crochet in the next stitch so repeat that all the way around so two single crochet increase all the way around until here at the end okay so after you're done with that uh, in our next row which is our fifth row we are going to do three single crochet increase three single crochet increase all the way around until the end for a total of 30 stitches so we're going to do one two three and then increase in the next stitch okay so repeat that six more times until here at the end okay so after that uh, in our sixth row we are going to do four single crochet increase and repeat all the way around for a total of uh, 36 stitches so we're going to do one two three four and then increase in the next stitch okay and then you're going to repeat that all the way around so four single crochet increase until the end okay so after you're done with your sixth row in the seventh until the tenth row we're going to do single crochet in each row for a total of 36 single crochet in each row so i'll see you when you're done with your 10th row and then we'll move on to the 11th row together okay so after we're done with our 10th row in our 11th row uh, we're going to do four single crochet and then uh, decrease and repeat all the way around six times for a total of 30 stitches so we're going to do one two three four and then decrease in the next two stitches okay and then you're going to repeat the same pattern again so for single crochet decrease all the way around until here at the end Okay, so after you're done with that, uh, in our next row, which is row 12 until row 14, uh, we're going to do single crochet in each row for the next three rows for a total of 30 stitches in each row. So I'll see you when you're done with your 14th row so that we start the 15th row together. Okay, so after our 14th row, in our 15th row, we are going to do three single crochet decrease and repeat all the way around until the end for a total of 24 stitches so we're going to do one two three and then decrease in the next two stitches okay so you're going to repeat that all the way around until the end Okay, so when you're done with this row, in the next two rows, which is row 16 and 17, we're going also to do single crochet all the way around for a total of 24 stitches in each row. So I'll see you when you're done with your 17th row, so that we do the 18th row together. Okay, so after you're done with your row 17, in our 18th row, we're going to do two single crochet decrease and repeat all the way around until the end for a total of 18 stitches so we're going to do one 
two and then decrease in the next two stitches Okay, and then you're going to repeat that all the way around until the end so two single crochet decrease all the way around until the end so after you're done with this row which is the 18th row in the next row which is our last row the 19th row you're going to do single crochet all the way around for a total of 18 stitches in that row so after you're done with your 19th row cut your yarn and uh, leave it long enough for sewing and then uh, fill up your body and then I'll show you how to do the arms okay so for the arms we're going to use this dark pink color and we're going to start to the magic ring and then we're going to do six single crochet into the magic ring okay so after that uh, in the second row we are going to increase all the way around until the end for a total of 12 stitches so we're going to do two single crochet in each stitch going to do single crochet increase all the way around until here at the end okay so after you're done with that uh, in our third and our fourth row we're going to do single crochet all the way around in each row for a total of 12 single crochet in each row so i'll see you when you're done with your fourth row so that we do the fifth row together after you're done with that in our next row which is our row five we're going to start with three single crochet so we're going to do one two three Okay, and then after that we're going to decrease three times so we're going to decrease one two and then one last time okay so after you're done with that so we have three stitches left so in the last three stitches we are going to do single crochet in each stitch so we're going to do single crochet one two three okay so after you're done with this which is the bottom part you're going to change into the light pink yarn which is the yarn for the main color and then after that we're going to do eight rows so for the next eight rows which is row 6 to 13 you're going to do single crochet in each row for a total of nine stitches in each row so i'll see you when you're done with that and then i'll show you how to make the legs Okay, so for the legs we're going to start to the magic ring and eight single crochet into the magic ring so you do eight single crochet inside the magic ring so i already did that so in our second row we're going to increase in each stitch for a total of 16 stitches in this row okay so we're going to start and do two single crochet in each stitch Okay, so continue and do two single crochet okay so do two single crochet in each stitch all the way around until here at the end okay so after you're done with your uh, second row so in our third row until our fifth row which is the next three rows we are going to do single crochet in each row for a total of 16 stitches in each row so I'll see you when you're done with the fifth row so that I show you how to do the sixth row. So after you're done with that, in our next row, which is our our sixth row, we're going to start with four single crochet first. So we're going to do one, two. three four okay and then after that we're going to decrease four times so we're going to decrease 
one. Two. Three. And then the last time. Four. Okay, so after we do that, we have four stitches left. So we're going to do a single crochet in each of the next four stitches. Okay, so we're going to do single crochet. Two. Three. And the last one, four. Okay, so after you're done with that, um, in our next seven rows, which is row seven until row 13, you're going to change into the light pink color, which is this one. And then for the next seven rows, you're going to do single crochet using this color for a total of 12 stitches in each row. Okay, so after you're done with your 13th row, I'll show you how to do the last row. Okay, so after you're done with your 13th row, in our 14th row, which is our last row, we are going to decrease all the way around until the end for a total of six stitches. So we are going to decrease in the next two stitches. Okay, so decrease also in the next stitches. Okay, so continue decreasing all the way until here at the end. So after you're done with that, I'll show you how to make the ears. Okay, so for the ears you're going to start with a chain two so we're going to do one two okay and then after we do a chain two we're going to start with the second uh, chain from the hook and we're going to do two single crochets in that chain so we're going to do one and two Okay, so after we do that, we are going to do a chain one and then we are going to turn. Okay, and then after we turn, we are going to do in the next, uh, in our row two, we are going to do three stitches in, an, in the next row. We are going to start here in the next chain and do single crochet, one, single crochet, and in the last here the last stitch we're going to do another single crochet so single crochet three okay so after that we're going to do a chain one again and then turn our work and in the next uh, row we're going to do four single crochets so we're going to do one three and in the last chain we do another one so four okay so we're going to repeat the same thing do a chain one and then turn your row and then you're going to do in the next row you're going to do five stitches so you're going to do one two three four five and then when you get to the end do a chain one and repeat all the way around okay so after you do so we'll do a total of so this is the other ear that i made so we'll do one two three four five six seven eight so repeat that until you have eight rows and then after you're done, I just did single crochet all the way around here for the edges. And then uh, you'll be done with your ears. So after you're done with that, uh, I'll show you how to make the muzzle. The nose or the muzzle, uh, we're going to start with magic ring and six single crochet into the magic ring in the first row. Then in the second row, we're going to increase all the way around for a total of 12 stitches in the next row okay so after that uh, in our third row 
we are going to work in the front loops only and we are going to do single crochet in the front loops only in each stitch for a total of 12 stitches so we're going to go in the front loop and do single crochet go in the next front loop also do single crochet and then continue like that all the way through in the front loop only doing single crochet all the way around until the end so after you're done with that uh, in our fourth row which is our last row we're going to do single crochet in the back loop of the second row so as you can see we have these uh, protruding parts so we're going to go in the second row uh, the protruding parts and then we're going to do single crochet all the way around okay so we're going to do single crochet and then go in the next back loop and do single crochet okay also do the same thing in the next loop do single crochet okay so you're going to repeat that all the way around until you get to the end okay so you're going to have uh, two protruding paths like this okay so when you're done with that you're going to cut off your yarn and leave uh, one that is long enough to sew in the parts together okay and then after you're done with that you're going to do the tail and for the tail it's very easy so what do you do you do a chain seven and then after you do a chain seven uh, you're going to start with the second chain from the hook and do two single crochet in each chain all the way around for a total of 12 chains so you have uh, the tail which is uh, which is like that which coils like this okay and then when you're done with that I'll show you how to join the parts together Okay, so guys as you can see I finished attaching the parts together so I already told you how to attach the eyes before so what I did is I attached the mouth between the two eyes and uh, for the ears I make sure they are in a line uh, with the eyes and you're going to count uh, you're going to count one two three so in the fourth row uh, from the top and also the same with this one so it's going to go all the way until here so make sure the eye is between the two ears between the ear and for the arms also it's uh, it's supposed to align together with the ears like that and the same case with this one so for the legs uh, I decided to attach them like uh, this way so that you can sit down so what you do is um, you're going to put to uh, to use the pins first to attach the two legs to see uh, how it's supposed to sit well so that it can sit by itself and also for the for the tail I attached it here at the very back between uh, the two legs so I counted one two three four five six so between the seventh and the eighth row that's where I attached the tail so I made this little bow tie I made just a long chain and then I tied it over here so it makes it look better so guys if you have a problem attaching the parts together you can comment uh, below or ask your question below and then I'll try to answer them so I hope you enjoyed this video if you haven't subscribed to my channel please subscribe and check out my other videos until next time Bye.